on the paths of comets. Standing outside the back door in dressing gown and pyjamas, sleep clearing, I wonder why they woke me. My older brother looks up, bounces on his toes. Our father crouches and points to a place in the sky, shifting closer to sight along his arm. I feel the warmth of him. There is a silvery line among the stars. It's a comet, he says, on a journey from the icy cold. Comet, a new word. The tail is dust and gas, my brother tells me. Feeling their excitement, I know I should be sharing it. Where's it going? I ask. I'm with friends on the university campus behind a bank of pine trees shielded from the town's lights. In the field of my binoculars, I find a grey mass without tail or clear edge, hardly the fiery omen of the Bayer tapestry. But I've learned my father's thrill at such faint evidences. Here is a remnant from the formation of the solar system. A recurrent visitor, Halley's Comet is of the type they call short period. I'll be a hundred next time it comes around. I hope we'll get a better display, and that my eyes are up to it. It is July, 1994. A string of mountains in space are closing on Jupiter at 37 miles a second. They will detonate just over the horizon from our earthbound view, each impact many times hotter than the surface of the sun. The gas giant's rotation will quickly bring any damage into view, and Hubble will see it all. We wait by the television, my father and I, impatient for the first image to be released. And there it is, the impact marked by dark spots in the swirling atmosphere. A journey of more than four billion years is done. It is 2014. The fillet lander approaches a barbell of ice and dirt tumbling in space. Touchdown is a glancing blow, its resting place a shadow. In the last minutes of its precious battery, it sends back the image of a cliff. My father, too, has gone, his journey passing beyond my knowledge. Orbiting cameras search for the lander's remnants, revealing the comet's blasted surface in ever clearer detail, its texture like old skin. Near perihelium, it begins to glow. Gases erupt, rubble and dust are ejected into space. The very thing that makes it shine is eating it away. <laughs>